Good morning, guys. Good morning. I've been up since I woke up at four for him. Good morning. Good morning. The sun is just coming up at 6.45, but I've been up since 4.45 or 4.30. But anyway, I've been on my Kobe Bryant night, so I'm going to post this. I didn't even my hair or nothing. I didn't already ate dinner at 6.47. Now I ate dinner at 6 o'clock, but I had a huge smoothie. I uh, dropped, downed it, but I just wanted to get on here and do a little vlogging and because I need this, you know, anyway, I watched, uh, I was cracking up at Dalvin. I don't know if you watch Zaddy Chunk Chunk, but ZCC, I've been watching him and his, um, his bestie, Nicole, of course, they conversation be cracking me up the way they be acting. And um, the Grim Wade family, I love watching them too. I was just making a comment just a moment ago. But yeah. And uh, they was talking about, um, Zaddy was talking about asking her if she was getting a COVID shot. But I think she already had COVID. Like me, she's, <clears throat> excuse me, already had COVID. And um, uh, speaking of COVID, like she said, when I caught it, I should have combed my hair. I brushed my teeth though. I always gotta brush them. Anyway, I gotta comb my big old bush. But anyway, yeah, she was saying that um she uh she couldn't taste or smell, I think. For me, I think I think I had COVID like two or three times. Cause at the time I was working for Pizza Ranch. <clears throat> and I wrote a book because yes, I was making big dollars at pizza ranch so i wrote a book on how to how to do that how to treat people it's basically how to treat people and people will be gladly to uh generously generously pay you for being kind and thoughtful and loving and caring anyway at the time when yeah when i was at pizza ranch the when I went back to work after we were laid off for four months, because mostly everybody was laid off from what, March 15th, March, April, May, June, July. Yeah, to the end of July. And I went back to work in August and I worked all the way through. And uh, and I swear, I've, I, I know I've had COVID like at least twice, minimum. But I think I'm suspicious, maybe three. Because the first time I caught it, because everybody at Pizza Ranch caught it. And unfortunately, the owner's wife, she she um, she succumbed to to it. Uh, rest her soul. Anyway, uh, so like Nicole, of course, Nicole, she said she couldn't smell or taste. I think it's taste. So for me, I couldn't smell or uh, taste. And that's not like me, like because I have a bloodhound nose. I can smell the slightest of anything. Like my nose, I got a sniffer on me like a bloodhound. And I knew something was wrong. I knew I had it because I, was, I told my mom, I was like, man, I can't smell nothing. And I'm talking about stuff that I normally, cause see, I'm a flower girl, like my Canterbury bells and stuff like that. So I always smell, like I can smell those easily. <clears throat> I can pick up like uh uh, gas, like any kind of gas smells, any kind of smoke smells. Like I'm the first to pick it up because I'm like, I smell some smoke, and everybody in the house will be like, "Well, I smell nothing." I'm like, "Yes, there's some smoke." Or I can smell if you, since I don't smoke, you know, I can smell if somebody smokes, or if somebody like has marijuana on them, any of that. I can pick up smells like from a mile away. So when I wasn't able to do that. And we was testing stuff like burners. Like if you turn the eye on and maybe something's on the burner or if there's a flame or a fire, you can smell it burn. I pick, I'm the first one to pick up the scent like quickly. And, um, <clears throat> excuse me. So anyway, um, yeah, I knew I was like, I got it. I know I have it. Cause before I was like that for like five days, I could not smell. I could not taste none of that. So, and that was last year. So one, that's one reason why I'm not taking the COVID shot because I've already had it. I've been exposed. 
And then like, I say two months after that, I had like this ridiculous amount. Cause for me, I zip around. I have, I, I always keep loads of energy. Cause you know, I keep like all kinds of like different, like organic herbs and like turmeric. Um, I think at the time, yeah, and I keep like, during this entire pandemic, I've had like the elderberries. I keep like all the elderberries on deck. I keep bags and bags. I make that with lots of honey, like, you know, the whole honey, not the, like the creamy honey, the unprocessed gritty honey. I keep the whole, like, basically what the bees spit out. I keep all of that on deck. <clears throat> so I keep all of that. So you know, because the thing is, you know, uh, COVID is just a really acute pneumonia. So that means severe inflammation, especially, unfortunately, the lungs are the, the clear, uh, obvious target. So I keep everything that protects the lungs and inflammation. Now, nothing is 100%. And plus, I got I was getting the intravenous vitamins to help intravenously and and at the time, I, you know, I cut all dairy, all meat, everything that inflames the body. You know, uh, white sugar, like um, processed foods. I cut all that. And that way, and I need to go through my hair. That way, uh, it helps with fighting the inflammation, you know. So the flu or the COVID flu can run its course, run its course, and then... As your immune system continues to fight and everything that helps keep your body from being inflamed um, helps it, you know, stay healthy, you know, recover faster. So anyway, I think like the second time I caught it was like two months after I had the first um, episode. And um, and that in that time, I was like, I even went, I still went to work, but. I was like super fatigued. Like I felt like I was just like, there was like another person hanging on my shoulders. Like somebody just dragging like a 200 pound person just hanging on me, like a heavyweight, you know? And I was like, nah, cause I'm gonna be honest. I wasn't wearing a mask. I'm still not wearing a mask. And I was all hugging everybody, loving everybody. And, uh, so yeah. So twice, I know twice for a fact, I had it. And then, so to me, I'm like old school. Like <clears throat> growing up, they was like, make mud pies, get dirty, expose yourself, challenge your immune system, you know? And, uh, you know, do, you know, do that. Plus and two, you know, in America, we have lots of like processed foods, a lot of stuff that we shouldn't be eating. And it doesn't help your body properly fight something of this magnitude and not saying that you can't you know succumb because you know when it's your time it's your time you know but I think that when it comes to like um like helping yourself you know being mindful of what you consume getting plenty of rest exercise you know keep your body strong stay positive I think all that helps and of course possibly genetics so genetic, you know, genetic disposition. So yeah, yeah, yeah. But I was cracking up with the the uh, the uh, Grimwade family because uh, their son he's going to go off to school, and they were talking about how he uh, how he uh, I think they homeschooled him. They were saying their kids have been homeschooled. I love the Grimwades. I've been following the Grimwades, Zaddy Chunk Chunk. Well, actually, I've been following. Zaddy's mom, B loves. I've been following her since 2017. But you can tell my wife is boring. I'm talking about them. But um, no, the only thing I'll be doing is, of course, y'all know I love my flowers, especially Canterbury Bells. And I've just been doing artwork. And here's a piece I'm working on. But uh, this is for a new book I'm about to, a new adult coloring book of my artwork. And then, uh, yeah, I'll be you know, like setting up situations where I'm preparing now to get ready to do some art, major art shows. I took most of my art down because um, I'm moving. So, and I'll be putting up new artwork and doing new stuff. And uh, yeah, I'm moving, which you can tell because I sold my sofa. 
I sold my chair, so I'm going to be redecorating. I'll get a new white sofa. I love, like, light sofas. So I'll get a new leather white sofa or a light blue, some kind of light color. And then, because I like light colors mixed with darker colors. So that's my, 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 I, I, I don't know what it is, but that's what I love. I love that decor. It just seems to brighten up a room to me. But anyway, I thought I'd jump on here for a few minutes, post this video, and I'm going to try to vlog. Because I changed my schedule. Normally, I stay up all night. But like now, I'm going to go to bed early. And I was like, let me give Kobe Bryant's uh, schedule a chance. So I've been doing some lighting better. Yeah, the lighting better is way better right there. Anyway, I've been doing... Oh, you see me? Get out of the mirror. I need to start working out some more. But hopefully I get a chance to move to the beach and then y'all come and work out with me on the beach when the sun rises at 5 a.m. So I'm doing the Kobe Bryant thing. So we're going to see how that works out for a little bit. And yeah, I'm just pacing the floor. I need to get one of those. Uh, uh, I had one. The, um, the what's the name that clamps onto the phone stabilizer? You can walk around with it. I had one, but I'm not sure what I did with it. Hmm. I'm gonna have to just probably buy a new one. But I'm gonna have to do my hair. I was thinking about cutting it. Because it's so long now that I just put it in a ponytail and keep it in a ponytail. My neighbor gave me some of these hats, but I'm selling this one. I'm going to sell that one. Everybody's starting to get up because it's Monday morning. Time to get up, get up. Welcome to the world. Say hello, world. Anyway, y'all, I am about to jet. I thought I'd jump on here and post because I got. I want to say hi to all my subscribers. God bless y'all. I pray y'all doing good. Leave me some messages. I know Phoenix LaRue, she's been looking her best, her fab, feeling great. Shout out to Phoenix and all the besties, the the old crew, road crew. And uh, yeah, it's your girl. Hey, y'all have a blessed day and I will check you out later. And stay, uh, yeah, stay prayed up, stay happy, happy as you can be. And um to share, I'm gonna go do my hair. I'll see y'all later. Y'all take care. To share.